cooking. Over here cooking some um vegan beef pasta. So this um Alfredo vegan Alfredo beef Alfredo and this looks so good. Let me show y'all how it's looking in the pot there. This is just the veggies. Alfredo. Like onion, um scallions, uh sweet pepper and I don't have any tomatoes so that will do with some seasoning a jamaican seasoning some jamaican ginger seasoning jamaican seasoning slap your mama some cayenne pepper and some black pepper and yeah that's all i use but no salt because <laughs> baby girl <laughs> we don't use salt over here let me hurt my shoe now so this is i'm using beyond beef yeah beyond beef and I'll be back. I'll be back. Yeah, I'll be really back. So once your food tastes good without salt. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I'm done with that. Because it's going to be like a debate. So you know what? I'm going to stop debating here. But learn not to cook with your food with salt. Okay? Learn not to. Because it's not good. It's for black people. It's not good. Yeah. I'm black, so bitch, I can't cook with salt. But my food still come out good, but it is what it is. I don't have no makeup. I know my face looking so nice and clear. But I got me a pimple here. I don't know if it's that love bump, as they would say in Jamaica, love bump. But I got me a pimple here. And I think somewhere right here. But I put me like a black eyeliner on it to make it look like a like um like a beauty mark so make it make sense y'all please make it make sense like you having um seasons are salt is already in the season right and you're adding salt to the food right make it make sense because like, it doesn't make no sense to me right now i can't cook without pepper put some pepper in here and I'm gonna chop up some pepper, some this pepper. I was gonna put some bird pepper in it, like some little pepper. Let me show you how it does. This is it, nice bird pepper. And I'm gonna put it in there, give the food a nice flavor. But I'm so lazy. I'm not gonna put no. I ain't gonna chop up no bird pepper right now because I'm so lazy right now. So I'm just gonna put this pepper in it, and it will do. So I just put her in the pot and just like smooshing her in. Let me show y'all so y'all can see what I'm doing. So, this is her in the pot. This is how she stays in the pot. You just like smush her in, just smush her until she's gonna be like really crumbled up into like, yeah. So, I just keep doing that for like a minute, and yeah. So, I'm just I just cut up the pepper, put in it. I gotta wash my hands too because I don't even have to smell like pepper to, to have the pepper stain or scent on it. So this is the sauce I'm using. This is ragu. Ragu. And it is um roasted garlic parmesan sauce. So how I cook this beef hair, this beyond beef, is that it's vegan. It's vegan, it's not like real beef, it's just vegan. I don't know what it is. But it tastes so good, like, trust me, you gotta try it, Beyond Beef, so good. So, I'm gonna show you how it looks, okay. So, this is how it's supposed to look, very, like, like, um, like, taco beef. This is how it's supposed to look, like, taco beef, very grainy, and... So, after that, I'm gonna add my, um, my ragu. So, you shake it up, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, until everything is well cooperated, you... Just do that and then I turn it, pop it open. Purr. That is her. She's looking. It smells good too. Let's pour it in. And then, you know what? Why pour it in and leave this in it, you know? I pour a little water in it and then I shake it up. Not a little water. Then I cock it up and then I shake it. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Shake it, you know, 
And it creates sauce. The extra the sauce that was in it is still, you know, it's shaked up. Get water. So, um, so the first thing I do when I'm cooking my beef or whatever, I put oil, a little bit of oil, not too much oil, because I'm going to put the sauce on. Sauce is going to bring, you know, sauce. So, put a little oil, a little oil. Then I put some on, some garlic in it, some minced garlic in it. And, um, yeah, I chop it up, like, use, like, two spoonful of minced garlic. And then I just, you know, just let it, um, saute. And then I add my, my seasoning, which is my onion, my scallion, my sweet peppers, my yellow and my red sweet peppers. And then I add pepper to it because I don't need this house to smell like pepper. Because when I fry pepper, when the oil is really hot and you put hot pepper in it, trust me, you'll be coughing out your lungs. Trust me. But we don't need that over here. We don't need that over here. So, it's been what? I don't know. I don't know how much minutes, y'all. I've been, like, jamming on TikTok here with some music. But, yeah, that's what I've been jamming. Oh, it's, like, bubbling. I like to see that. So, oh, that's kind of what I'm seeing in the part right now. So, what I'm seeing the part right now. That so means she's, like, cooked. The sauce is well cooked. Then, next thing I'm going to do is put my gas I was draining her, so she's good to go. So, I'm going to put my pasta in there. I'm so addicted to washing my hands all the time. Every little thing that I touch, I always wash my hands. I don't know. Do y'all do that? Or I'm just the only one that's do that. I don't know. I yeah, really touch, I touch. I always wash my hands. <laughs> Ooh. So I cover it. I'm going to turn it down to like four. And leave it to cook for a good 15 minutes. So hold up. Hey Google. Set timer for 15 minutes. Sure, 15 minutes. Starting now. So, <laughs> I guess I say it's still 15 minutes. And it's cooking for 15 minutes. It's like cooking down to about 15 minutes. But I like how I cook the pasta. I didn't cook it like too soggy. Because I don't like soggy pasta. So it's not soggy. It's good. It's very tender. Yeah. So I'm going to sit down here and send me some music in Jane because... That's what I do, babe. So, you see the next clip. <laughs> so, you say this is like a what? Veterinarian um, meal, I would say. Yeah, I would say it's like a veterinary meal. Because that veterinary pasta. So, yeah, let's, let's try her. With one of the pasta, just one. Is it? Mmm. That's good. Mm. The flavor is in it. I love it. It is like it's spicy, but it's not like too spicy. Some people would be like really spicy, but I have a very high spicy tolerance, so I say it's not that spicy. Maybe it's gonna be really spicy. So yeah, we'll cover it. So this is how it looks. It's so delicious. This is the sound that I love to hear, man. So good. So it's her. She's looking nice. She's looking real nice. You know what you can have on the side? You can have some Hawaiian rolls. But I don't have any Hawaiian rolls with me. So I'm just going to have it as it is because some sweet bread would be good. Nice sweet buttery bread would be nice on the side, but... I'm okay. I'll just eat it as it is. Oh my gosh, it's so good. You can get the pasta at um 99 cent store. That's where I bought all my pasta because it's cheap. It's like 99 cent for a pasta. Yeah, so it's pasta. Pasta is all pasta. This one is like 
um veterinarian pasta i'm through cooking so y'all want to see how it turns out this is so good i'm gonna show y'all how it oh yeah hmm so how it looks this is how it looks really good it looks really good trust me it looks really good it smells really good <laughs> and hopefully it tastes really good i know it's going to so i'm going to take me some pictures of it and then i'm gonna go diving <laughs> let's dive in let y'all take the first bite it's good It's so good. So good. Mm. Mm. It's so good. I thought I heard something. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. It's spicy too, so 